What's going on guys, Kaisers here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon! Today we're going to be continuing on with our adventure and head on up to the second gym leader in Eterna City. So without further ado, let's get right into it! Also, I just wanted to let y'all know that by the time I'm recording this, it is St. Patrick's Day, so when this video does come out, I hope all of you had a wonderful St. Patrick's Day, and I hope you are having a good day in general, you know? So let's just continue on with our adventure. And hey, there's a drowsy here. Alright, let's see what this item is right here. A thick club. And... cross chopped. You're dead. 546 experience for that little thing. She's learning Seed Bomb. Why are you learning Grass Moves? You're a water type. And you also have a Cascoon. And you have a Chingling. Look at this, this thing kept spamming Amnesia to the point where it takes a Doom Desire and freaking five or six Power Gems, dude. That's nuts. Tanky little Bee Queen we have right here. Is there an item here? Yep, there was. Oh, lucky guess. An Everstone. And by the way, I really appreciate y'all enjoying the cloud montage I just uploaded the other day, because it was really actually fun playing cloud, and when the Final Fantasy remake comes out, I'll play it on my free time, because Royal, Persona 5 Royal comes out this month, and you know damn well I'm going to be playing that a lot. Star Ravia. A cast form. My little brother loves this dude. It's one of his, it's, I think it's his favorite Pokemon out of all of them. Oh god, what happened? All right, what's this item? Kabia Berry. Another pointless berry, huh? Thank you, lady, for healing our team. All right, let's see. Is there any items down here? Yes, there is. Koba Berry. All right, so now it's time we head into the forest. Oh, who is this chick's name? I forget. Cheryl. Okay. Okay, so your name is Kaiser. So I'm sincerely glad to meet you. May I ask a big favor? I want to get through the forest. Blah, 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 blah. All right, so Cheryl's going to go with us through the forest. Okay, so let's see if there is any items while we walk through this forest. A white flute. Looks like we got ourselves a double battle, so let's go. They got a Larvitar and a Matang, dude. What? And Cheryl has a Hypno. Alright, well, let's Earth Power Larvitar, because it's a higher level, and then I'm sure Hypno will do something. Why would you use Hail? Come on, man! This dude also has a Gengar, bro. Come on! Why would you... Uh, he has Metang and Gengar. What's next? Legendary? Ah! Nope. 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 Are you kidding me? I called it. I freaking called it, dude. This is so not fair. Oh my god. Why would he have a Deoxys? Oh my god. Freaking Deoxys. Right in his pocket. Wiki berry. Let's chill with the berries, please, and let's freaking get some good items, all right? Like an EXP share or something. Hmm, did we go through the grass or do the double battle? Let's do the double battle. You know, sometimes whenever I play Pokemon games, I kind of forget the certain Pokemon that exists, and Tropius is one of those. Because what is that? Is that like a dinosaur with, like, leaf wings? I never understood that. It knows Flare Blitz. Okay. And now it's a 2v1. Great. Oh, I forgot about the encounters in here. Magneton and Lotad. Like, they're good Pokemon, but I prefer to have the Pokemon that I have here. A Moonstone. Ooh, okay. We got, like, a couple more ways to go, and then I think we're out of here. hate to see it. You absolutely hate to see it. We probably couldn't even catch it. Ooh, another item. Let's see what you are. Right after this battle. Alright. A magnet. Don't need that on anybody, so... Stop following me! Please! <laughs> Just leave me alone. And we are out of the forest. Nice. And we get a soothe bell for escorting Cheryl out of here. Alright, so once we get cut, we are definitely coming back in here to see what's in the old chateau. Alright, Route 205. New Pokemon, let's see. No, 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 no. Come on.
This game sucks. Alright, let's harvest these berries real quick. And then we'll fight these trainers on the bridge, Durinberry. What's up with all the berries, man? Can we get some good items, please? Waterstone. There we go. That's way better than a freaking berry. Why didn't we get something like that earlier? Why does everybody have good Pokemon? Come on. Another freaking Gengar? Beedrill. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, Dragonfly could take a Beedrill, no problem. It had space. It had Palkia's move. It had Palkia's move. It had spatial freaking Ren, dude. Oh my god. Ah, uh, Floatzel. The OG water from Gen 4. You didn't have- you didn't play Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum, right, if you didn't have one of these on your team. Oh, God. <gasps> oh, my God! <laughs> How? How are you alive, Melanie? You're a legend! Oh, my God! <laughs> Okay, yep, I gotta do grinding. I gotta do grinding. No more grinding for the lower levels until I get like an EXP share or something. Absolutely not. Holy shit. I cannot believe that just happened, dude. Oh my god. That's twice we had like a near-death experience with like a super effective move. First Willy with Zap Cannon, and now freaking Melanie with Eruption from a random freaking Float Soul. Oh my god. Why does the fisherman have a Venusaur? Why is everyone getting good Pokemon, man? This is not fair! Holy cow, dude. I am so shocked, Melanie. I am so sorry, sweetheart. I will not send you out again until we get an EXP share for you or grind somewhere else. Oh my god, that's it. I'm keeping Porky out until we get an EXP share, bottom line. Alright, all those trainers are taken care of, so let's go heal Melanie fast. Cause she needs healing! <laughs> Let's find a Pokemart so we can get some Pokeballs cause we bought- fought a lot of trainers so we should have a good amount of money in our pocket. Let's get 11 more Pokeballs. Let's get 5 Super Potions. There we go. Should be good now. Alright, I think we have to go up here to the statue or something like that if I remember correctly. Yep. It's my ass! He returns! So there's the statue, and look, it's freaking Cyrus again. Sinnoh's myth. Its truth needs investigation. Pardon me. Stand aside. Why are you asking us to move when there were stairs down below and then there's one literally you could go around my ass and you could literally go around me? Why are you forcing us to move? Come on. Little bitch. Alright, so before we go to the gym, there's one route over here that we can go to. So let's see if we can catch a Pokemon here. Oh, there's a pond here too. Oh, so let's fish real quick and see if we could find something. Alright, come on, game. Give me something good, please. Give me something. Come on. We have Melanie on the team! Ah! Alright, this was the route I'm talking about. Route 211. We've had Wurmples, we've had Snow Runs. Just give us something, please. Something good. Red Flute. Okay, let's see what this kid has. A Hitmonlee and a Swalot. We can actually send Dragonfly out, because it can dig it, and then it could get some big boy experience. Look at that, 504 experience. Mm-mm-mm, that is good. And what else? Ponyta. Aw, Ponyta gave us a present. The present hurt. Okay, let's see, is there anything else on this route we can get, or is that it? Ah, Anorith! Armaldo is my second favorite fossil, dude. Number one being Tyrantrum, which is my favorite Pokemon in the entire series. Oh, I'm so sorry, little guy. Sorry you can't be part of the team. We could go down there, but I f eh, I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna go back to the gym. Let's head back, heal up. Oh, it's Cynthia! Hands down the best champion out there. All right, Cynthia gave us cut. Thank you so much. God, dude, Cynthia gives so much nostalgia when it comes to Pokemon. Just her theme and her fight in general, dude. Oh my god, I love her. Alright, now that we're all healed up, we can take on the gym. Oh yeah, I re remember, it was like in a little alarm clock, and we had to like fight the trainers to move it around. Oh God, dude, so many memories from this. Alright, there we go, the clock moves as you defeat the trainer, dude. That's so cool. 
God, dude, I remember this gym so much. Oh, I feel like I'm a, I feel like a kid again, honestly, dude. I love this series so much. I can't anymore. Oh my god! Why? Why does everyone have such good Pokemon, dude? Why would the Grass Trainer have, in my opinion, one of my favorite Fire-type starters, dude? I know Charizard is seen as, like, overhype. I don't think he's, like, the best Pokemon out there. In my opinion, he's one of the greatest starters, Fire starters out there. Tick-tock, tick-tock, tick-tock. There we go. Last Trainer, and then it's the Gym Leader. Ursaring. She got Mamba Bear on her. Alright, Gym Leader number two, Gardenia. Here we go. You kept me waiting. I'm Eterna's Gym Leader, Gardenia, the Grass-type Master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. Gym Leader number two, Gardenia. Alright, what are you leading us off with? Torchic! Let's Earth Power that to Oblivion. There we go, easy money. Rapidash. Well, Gardenia is in the Grass-type Gym Leader. It looks like it's more like the Fire. Let's Earth Power that again. Level 30. You hype us up with these cool Fire-type Pokémon. And that's your ace. Cascoon! Okay, then. There we go. And Dragonfly gets the crit. Let's go, buddy! Atta boy! Second gym down, baby, let's go! Received the forest badge. Nice, two gyms down, six more to go. And TM86, which was, I believe was Grass Knot. Did she say Body Slam? Sure was. I think, yeah, this, wasn't this the house we need the Explorer Kit or something? There we go, I remembered. Now if I remember, we go down here and we get the EXP share. It's like the scientist or something right here, right? Yep. Give it to me. Yes! EXP share! Now we can start leveling up the boys. Let's give the EXP share to Draco. Because she's he's the lowest leveled on the team and he needs some experience. Oh, that's right. We need to learn... We need to teach cut to someone. Hmm. Let me quit. I'll be right back. I'm going to quickly see if Stunky, the... Stun uh, the Pokemon I caught a while back can learn Cut, because I don't want to teach Hammerhead that. Alright, I'm back, so it turns out Stunky can learn Cut, so until after we clear out the um, tower or whatever, we will bring Hammerhead right back into the party. He's temporarily shoved into the box until the end. We're going to keep him in the PC until we um, clear out that tower. But unfortunately, we are going to have to do that in the next episode. So thank you all again so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and comment down below saying that you enjoyed. If you're new, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way, whenever you see me upload, you guys will be the first to know. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will talk to you all in the next next episode. Peace.